Hey guys, welcome back to, I can't remember what part it is now, four, I think? Three or four part of my showing off my collection. Um, I just did all these, like, fast food and random figures in the last part. Oops, sorry. And there'll be a link so you can see the other parts. I forgot, and I'm so embarrassed about this, but these two Bondi figures, I totally, they didn't make the cut, apparently. But, um, Palkia and Darkrai, and they're so sweet, I don't know how I could forget about them. So yeah, those are like the Bondi finger puppets. I totally forgot about them. I'm so sorry. Anyways, this I think I'm gonna make this the last part because some of these figures that are coming up aren't like the most important ones. But yeah. So anyways, here's a Seal Tommy figure. Um, Dragonite, which I'm really I love this one because I've had this for a long time. I just found it this spring, I believe, and I whoa, I hadn't seen it in maybe maybe 12 years or so. I really... Oh, such a long time. Pidgey! Pidgey? But I would send this to um, the Pidgey dude, but I don't know why he won't let me send him stuff. So, whatever. If you want this, you can have it. <laughs> I want to send you stuff like other people do. Anyways, Larvitar. Just tell me figure. You're looking badass. Um, what do we have here? Here are some more Tommy figures, I believe. Yeah. Raichu. Very nice. Wigglytuff. We have Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff. Strangely enough, Jigglypuff is quite a bit bigger than Wigglytuff. And Falling Pikachu. I remember I had all three of those at one point. I don't have them anymore. Here is a really cute Chansey, which is also a pencil topper. I love the pencil toppers. They're really fun. Okay, so this is kind of, these are so many of these figures. I bought them actually to make jewelry out of them. I have made and sold a lot of jewelry with them. But let me just push this aside. I have a bunch of these teeny tiny, I think they're just like some cheap Chinese ones. But um, they're really cute. Some of them are, you know, they're kind of perfectly imperfect. Not in the best shape ever. You can see some of them have like those loops in their heads because I'm making jewelry out of them or something. Tokopi. I have Plusel and Minum, but I don't know where the other where Minum is. For alligator. Yeah. Dragonite. Tiny, they're super, super tiny. Look at this itty bitty tiny Ivysaur. And then actually, I don't know if I even want to go through all of them, but like, uh, I have this whole bag full of these ones. And it's got like Alkazam, Jolteon. I'm sorry, Jolteon. Uh Squirtle. Arcanine, Vile Plume. These are just the ones I like the best because they're um, first gen. So, uh, Magikarp, Alakazam, which is actually pretty well done for some cheap, crappy Chinese one. <laughs> Suicune. I had two Suicunes, but I used one for necklace. Um, oh, my camera! Sea King! Duh, hello! Graveler, Gloom. Oh, I just have so many. Blastoise, Zubat, Golbat, which is weirdly enough a lot smaller than Zubat. <laughs> mm, yeah. This weird, I think it was like from the movie, wasn't it, or something? Uh, Mewtwo, when he was dressed up in that weird suit. Yeah. So that's how he was created. I can't remember. It's like all kinds of reasons. And then I have, oh, so many! I have all these ones. Um, also, yeah, Ninjask. Floatzel. Just a bunch. Aaron. So many. Palkia with no arms. It came with no arms, weirdly enough. Regirock. Mm. What do you call? Manectric. Oh my god, I totally forgot about that. Oh, I should have sent this to um, Manectric Returns because I did a trade with him and um, yeah, I don't need it, so I should have sent that. Sorry, maybe I will another time. Mantine, really weird Mantine. Um, Electrovire. Regice. Which actually also has one of those loop things. I thought I was going to make a charm out of it. I don't know now. I might just not do it. Napoleon. Giratina, which looks so weird. Does not really look like Giratina that much. I mean, it does, but it's like too tiny or something. I don't know. Scissor. 
um, I have a site there too that I put in like a glass bottle and made it into a necklace. I love that one. That's on my site too. Slacking. Combuskin. Yeah. So yeah, I have so many of these. I have way more than I showed, but ugh, it's getting overwhelming. Yeah. So yeah, I could keep talking about these. I mean, yeah, Munchlax. Yes. Philipper. Um, Reggie Gigas, Reggie Gigas, Vigora. I've got, I've got literally, I have so many. Unifly. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. If there are any of these that you guys are interested in, or you know, you want to trade for, if they, I have, if you have a figure you want, and you have a figure I want, like go for it. Totally hit me up. Just hit me up. The Bondi figures I'm going to be a little bit more picky with, simply because a lot of them are crazy rare, and a lot of them are hard to get because they're Japanese import. Um, but like these guys, <laughs> I could totally like if we traded other figures, I would throw one of these or a couple of these in for free, just because like yeah, they didn't cost me shiz, and they're kind of what is this? Is this an actual Pokemon? I don't know. But, yeah, so, yeah, so, if, if you're interested in any of these, oh, Magmortar, then, you know, just write, write to me, write to me. Anyways, that was my collection of Pokemon toys. I still have a few more Bondi and stuff like that, but, um, yeah, <laughs> and these were literally just the, what do you call, fast food ones and then the tiny ones. The Bondi ones are put away in the box, so, as you can see, I have quite a few. Anyways, thanks for tuning in, guys. I was really happy to show off my collection, and hopefully it will grow in the future. And, yeah, so thanks for tuning in.